cave painting is the most historic way of image-based storytelling. What has been found so far is some of the earliest artwork that has ever been created. Most of the art dates back to the Ice Age, which happened between 40,000 and 14,000 years ago. At this time, Neanderthals were still living alongside humans, but they were getting close to extinction. Caves provide the shelter against the harsh climate of the Ice Age, as well as a canvas to start recording what they had seen or done. There are around 400 caves located across Europe and Southeast Asia, with most being found in France and Spain. People, woolly mammoths, woolly rhinos and hyenas were regularly depicted in cave paintings and to help us to understand what the world was like throughout the Ice Age. In order to create paintings, people need paint, and the paint of our ancestors was very different to the paint we use at home and in our classrooms today. They made paint using different types of earth for red, yellow and brown colours, and charcoal for black. These materials were then mixed with either animal fats, blood, or saliva. They don't sound like the most durable materials, do they? But as these paintings are still standing today, we think our ancestors did a good job with the resources available to them, don't you think? How do you think people put the paint on the walls? Well, it definitely wasn't with a paintbrush. They did use their fingers and hands, which we imagine was quite fun. But remember, our ancestors were smarter than we give them credit for. They created tools. They sprayed the paint onto the walls by blowing it through hollowed out animal bones. One reason for painting on the cave walls was shamanistic, as our ancestors believed that by painting the animal they wanted to eat, it would appear, and they'd be able to capture it for their dinner. However, the main reason for cave painting was similar to our humans now create art, to communicate. It was a way of telling people that I saw this, or I was here, just like people do today when they upload something to YouTube. 